talk about the atrial conduction system. The SA node, or the sinoatrial node, gets its name because it's located near the coronary sinus. The coronary sinus is the great vein of the myocardium, and that's where the blood from the myocardium empties into in the right atrium. The SA node is the primary pacemaker or lead pacemaker of the heart. Its intrinsic rate is 60 to 100 beats per minute. The SA node is supplied by the right coronary artery, and the electrical impulses travel along the internal pathways so rapidly that both the squeezing of the right and left ventricle happen simultaneously in a healthy heart. Whenever we start to see enlargement of the right antria, we'll see a tenting of the P wave, a voltage of greater than 2.5 little blocks. Whenever we see enlargement of the left atria, we'll see an emming P wave, and that's those P waves becoming different with an M appearance of the P wave. Remember, M mitral. And that's because there's a conduction delay, because there's more muscle mass in the left atrium to squeeze, thus they're slowing along the horizontal axis, which is time. But in a healthy heart, the SA node fires between 60 and 100 beats per minute, and those electrical impulses travel into the left atria via the Bachmann's bundle. It continues to travel down to the right atria via the anterior nodal tract, the middle internodal tract, and the posterior internodal tract until these impulses reach the AV node, which acts as a gatekeeper to the ventricles. It's a gatekeeper and that it also prevents any electrical activity from the ventricles from traveling up to the atria. And it allows the ventricles to be filled by the atria. So the AV node has many functions. Like, follow, Remember to hit the bell for more videos.